Call it an elevating experience, or exercise, or just played fun. Where it comes to bouncing, or balancing, or even falling, what's not to like? Entire families get in the mood. Quite fun. I really loved it. Since summer 2014, Rise from the US has been operating what it calls one of its ultimate trampoline parks in a Hong Kong high-rise. It's first in Asia at times attracting over a hundred customers per hour through its doors each day. When we did open the doors here, they practically exploded off of the hinges because it just I've never seen such a response as we got from the people of Hong Kong. With over 20 affiliated operating facilities in the US and two in Scotland, the company says it's the largest developer, owner and operator of indoor trampoline parks in the world. Finding the optimum floor space of 12,000 square feet and at least 18 feet floor to ceiling is no small challenge, but Hong Kong's advantages still jump out. Hong Kong's just an amazing place. It is the heart of the Asia Pacific region. Uh, and we find that it could be an excellent springboard uh, once we decide to begin pushing into other parts of Asia. There's easy access to, say, Singapore, Taipei, mainland China, uh, even getting up into Japan. With custom-made trampolines and equipment from the US, RISE aims to make its experience truly awesome. People with a higher skill level, of course, can, can do a lot more. I've seen people actually do flips on the slack line, which is pretty amazing. We've also got a uh, basketball court, we've got a dodgeball court, and then of course our other massive foam pit, which are higher grade trampolines, where people want to be a little more daring, try some things that maybe they wouldn't normally try on the regular trampolines, they can do that. Safety is the highest priority, given the different skill levels of customers, and insurance needs to be dependable. By the same token, insurance premiums in Hong Kong are seen as significantly lower than in the US due to Hong Kong's less litigious culture. Hong Kong's simple low tax regime is another game changer, but hardly on the minds of people bent on having fun. This is a chance for them to, to be free, you know, to do something that is a little bit naughty, but yet they can you know, be safe. It's a great opportunity for the kids. There's nothing else like it in Hong Kong. Having this big open space you rarely get in Hong Kong and it's clean, it's safe, it's very well organized and really well run and the kids really love it. When I heard of this place I was expecting one of those garden trampolines but when you come you realize actually they're very good quality and they actually give you good experience. As Rise's Gavin Grissom puts it, the sky's the limit for the company's leap into Asia if it can be prized away from Hong Kong. You're in the middle of the city for one, and then you can go, I know, 30, 45 minutes down the road, go to the south side of the island, and you're practically in a tropical paradise.